How to set up and use the BG Sentinel. If you need to monitor tiger mosquitoes in urban residential areas, sampling at fixed positions is most cost effective. Using the power from the homeowner will greatly extend the collection period and eliminate the need to constantly replace batteries. Longer trapping periods allow collection of large numbers of tiger mosquitoes even without CO2. All this together saves time and money. Dr. Scott Gordon, medical entomologist for over 40 years, will guide us through the setup of a trap in a residential area. When monitoring tiger mosquitoes in an urban or suburban area, it's always best to work with a homeowner. This way you can get access to electrical power to run the traps for the duration of the mosquito season, and it also provides a high degree of security for your trap. How are you? Working together with homeowners does not only provide advantages for you, the homeowner also benefits from having a trap that reduces nuisance biting. This is a good argument for the trap. Further, with less than 5 watts of power consumption, the trap can be run over the entire mosquito season for only a few dollars. Setting up the trap is easy. The pop-up design of the traps enables a fast assembly of the trap body. The attractant with artificial human odor serves to enhance the attractiveness of the trap and is sufficient to catch tiger mosquitoes. With extended collection periods, the use of CO2 is not necessarily required. The funnel with the catch bag is placed in the center of the cover. We recommend adding a rain shield to the trap. The rain shield protects the trap not only from rain, but also from falling leaves. Don't place the trap close to decks or patios and avoid sunny, windy, and unprotected locations. Traps should be placed where tiger mosquitoes hide. The best locations are shady, humid, and wind-protected, such as locations near rain barrels, bushes, or in vegetation. In many cases, the only electrical outlet available is located on the deck or patio and away from the optimal trap location. To solve this problem, extension cables are available that you can direct along the house, deck, or in bushes to protect it from damage when mowing the lawn. Now, the trap will run continuously during the whole study. See you next time. See you. Well, now that everything's set up and operating properly, I'll be back once a week just to check on things and to replace the collection bag. Then we take the mosquitoes from the collection bag and head on back to the lab to identify them. Back at the lab, Dr. Gordon freezes the captured mosquitoes and then identifies them as time allows. Because the mosquitoes collected with the BG Sentinel do not pass through the ventilator fan, they are usually in good shape to identify. Normally, we recommend to collect the catch every seven days. However, the condition of the mosquitoes can be negatively impacted by excessive rain, large numbers of mosquitoes in the catch bag, or even by the presence of insectivorous predators which may devour the catch. In these cases, shortened collection periods are recommended. In contrast to a collection where you set up the trap one day and pick it up the next, a continuous monitoring in established fixed positions with extended collection periods makes data collection more efficient. Setting up trap sites only once saves time and money.